I get a lot of questions from traditional martial artists who practice traditional Chinese um, Kung Fu, traditional Chinese martial arts, and they want to make a transition to MMA, kickboxing, and other combat sports. What advice would you give them? So to, to those those people, um, uh, the biggest advice would, would, uh, would be um, to have respect and humility. Um, the uh, traditional martial arts, or any martial arts really, um, and uh, the likes of modern Muay Thai Karate, uh, MMA, kickboxing are, are completely two, two, two different arenas. Um, the, the former is uh, more of, um, well, the former does not have the uh, the, the combative system of the second. Um, it doesn't have um, the, the, the real life sparring experience. So even if you can, you can be the master in one traditional martial art, doesn't mean you can um, translate those skills into a, 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 the modern combat sport uh, without the, the, the rigorous training, the, 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 the full resistance training, the sparring. Uh, so the biggest message will be uh, to be humble, um, to be respect respectful, and to have the fear before you, you transform into a full combat sport. So um, Chinese Kung Fu is beautiful, uh, Chinese, Chinese martial arts. Um, I come from a, a, a Chinese uh, uh, a Shaolin, uh, Wing Chun, Tai Chi background with decades of training. And that being said, um, they're not geared um, for modern combat sport. Chinese martial arts have many varieties, and although uh, uh, most of them are not applicable in the modern combat world, um, they are applicable in, in, in a bigger, bigger uh, territory. For example, your mental, mental health, uh, overall health benefits. Um, um, that, that being said, um, if we could start now um, applying many of the techniques of the Chinese traditional martial arts into um, in modern combat, and um, uh, we, we could see more varieties of, of, uh, of uh, techniques and tactics um, that can be applied into modern martial art. We believe uh, in the following years, uh, Chinese um, that there, there could be uh, more of uh, predominantly Chinese fighters in a modern uh, combat arena. Um, and uh, um, for, for everybody out there, um, please do practice Chinese martial arts because um, they're, they're to keep you fit, keep you healthy. Um, not everyone comes to the gym and want to become uh, a champion. Um, that being said, uh, there are many other benefits. Uh, and, and, uh, and, and, and the second is um, um, if we do uh, want to uh, utilize some of the skills from uh, Chinese, modern, uh, Chinese traditional martial arts, um, that's also a, a, a new route for us. That's fantastic, man. <laughs> I, I always say everybody, not everybody needs to be a fighter, but everybody should train.